Welcome to Draw Tip Tuesday! This is my watercolor box and these are my water brush pens. The water brush pen is a great tool. It has a tip just like any other normal brush. If you take the tip off, you can fill the small container with water, like this. You see, if you slightly press the container, it feeds water to the brush. For location painting, this is just perfect. I can just take it with me in my tool bag like this. No need to carry water containers to dip my brush in. Let me show you what it looks like to work with the water brush pen. By squeezing gently, I add water to the brush, just like I would when dipping my regular brush in water. Just gently put some pressure between thumb and forefinger if you want to add more water. Of course you can splash and splatter your paint just as well like when you use a normal brush. There are different sizes as well. Here's a thinner one. This is what I think about water brush pens. They rock! Speaking of things that rock, here's the tip of the day. Instead of a cloth, use a wristband. I picked this up from urban sketcher Liz Steele, who's been using this for ages. So clever! Especially when drawing on location, you might need to hold your watercolor box or your sketchbook. So then it's really easy to use the wristband to wipe off your brush. I hope this tip has been helpful. If it was, you might want to subscribe to my YouTube channel, so you don't miss out on my Draw Tip Tuesdays. Also, you can take a look at my website, koosjekoene.nl, for more good stuff. See you next week!